What's up guys, this is Pam with the Walk for the Sun here, and welcome to part 29 of Let's Play Grand Central 2. And, uh, well, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> so, um, yeah, time to do our fifth series in the second lineup, but once again, I gotta buy a car for it. And, uh, judging by the title of this video, you might be able to know what car I'm gonna be buying. So, yeah. It's also probably my favorite series in the- And this is also probably my favorite series in the entire game. You have to the title of this video. But, I mean, seriously, I love this series. It's probably my favorite series in the entire game. So yeah, and like I said, if you, and, and if you would look at the title, you would know what I'm talking about. If you look at the title of this video, you will know what I'm talking about. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that might be too slow. Wow, I think that's a lot of power. Yeah. Plus muscle car. Yeah, you should know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> Let's see. Oh yeah, the plus muscle car in this game, technically I would say this car is called a Roadrunner. I mean, seriously, this car looks like a Roadrunner. So I would just, I'm just gonna call this car the Plymouth Roadrunner in this game. Because that's what this car looks like. Or that car looks like. And of course we got the vehicle Superbird. A car, uh, yeah. Possibly. Uh, so done. Ah, nah, 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 nah. Now we need menus. See what Don has. Hmm. Nah. That car is probably gonna be too slow. No. That thing man look a hat that thing. It does say it has 384 horsepower, however, to me it goes a lot slower than that. So yeah, uh, let's see if we got Chevrolet. Uh, I swear, I have no idea what car to buy right now. Cool car is on that Camaro, though. Uh, we got this thing. Probably the fastest class of muscle car in the game. But if I remember correctly, this thing is really spin happy, so I'm not buying that. And of course, Stingray 82 doesn't count because it technically doesn't really meet the requirements. This one does, though. But I'm not buying that either. Ugh. See what Shelby has. Acura is not going to have anything. Uh, we got two of them here. We got the GT350. GT huh. And a GT500. I don't really know what car to... Actually, I think I know what car to buy. I am going to buy the GT350. Yeah. I I'm going to buy this car. We got five cars, but I'm going to go with green, because... You know me. And I think that's all I'm gonna do to it. So, um, yeah. I don't think I went into Upton's car at all in this series. At least I don't think so. But yeah, we're doing the fifth series and the second lineup, the Muscle Car Cup. Or, as I like to call it, the Miracle Muscle Car Cup. So, yeah. So, we have three tracks here, all in North America. Start with our first race in Sail Shore. As you can see, no, ho no horsepower requirement. Oh, crap. Alright, here we go. Also, I have a drink with me. I'm, I'm drinking uh, Mountain Dew Code Red. Because you know me, I love Mountain Dew. Um... Why is my... Oh, there we go. 
For some reason, my drums and buns were not working. I couldn't turn the car. My controller was like, no, you're not going to turn the car. So I don't know what that... Oh, my God. I don't know what it was, but my controller would not work for a second. The rain for four more were taken. I don't know. But, yeah, I don't know... I don't know... Uh, holy crap, this is crazy to drive. Yeah, yeah my uh, controller was not, like, was not working. Like, I'm just, like, like, I could not turn the car. The controller was just being stupid. So, yeah. So, uh, hooray for my controller not working. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, there's another Xiaomi in this race. And holy crap, he's faster than me. Oh boy, Xiaomi versus Xiaomi. This is the one that is. Hopefully, it will be me. Breaks. Or maybe not. Oh, I'm getting annihilated. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, my controller was being retarded. Thank you for clicking the wall, you idiot. Appreciate it. Uh, part of me is I don't know how to do a clean overtakes, but god dang it. Why won't, why won't this car freaking turn? My god, I may need to get racing tires. Also, uh, this is not good. The way you're going? Yeah. Alright, I took the lead back. How did I take the lead back? Oh god, we're not done yet. Oh god, finish line, finish line, finish line, finish line! Okay. Oh god, that was close. Oh. Well, that was a, uh, holy crap, I almost lost that race. This car is hard to drive. Especially when it doesn't turn well. Although, then again, uh, every classic muscle car doesn't turn well anyway, so it makes a lot of sense. Ah, uh, so, uh, yeah. Man, that Mountain Dew is, man, that Mountain Dew is good. P.T. Spider. That's technically not really a muscle car, but whatever, I... Good job, Dan, you made a mistake. You gave me a car that wasn't a muscle car. Right, anyways. So, time for our second race, and hopefully have less problems than we did on the first race, even though I won on my first race anyways. Careful, here we go. Like I said, hopefully this will give me less problems than the first race. Although it's mostly based on how I drive this car, because... Like... Ugh. This car can be quite a handful to drive. Yeah, this thing. Oh. And one thing you might be familiar with the classic muscle car. Is, in the, is the fact that these cars have horrible top speed. So yeah. Excuse me, Steve, right? You're kind of in my personal space. Thank you. Alright, I'm in the lane. Now let's see if I can... Well... I don't know. We... Boy over Johnson. Holy crap, this is a control! Okay, here we go. I'm not sure who the biggest threat is in this race. Well, I, well, I don't know who it is. It's gonna be that freaking stinger, right? Yeah, well. Yeah. And I am gone, honey. How'd that happen? 
man, the, the top speed on this car is probably about 125 or something. So, um, yeah, this car has horrible top speed. Luckily, I wouldn't need to worry about it in this race because there's only a couple of straightaways, but they're not that long. So, yeah. Not that corner I think of threat. <laughs> but it certainly is. It's like in every other classic muscle car series in every game, the corner's always a threat. I know as you can tell just now when I actually hit top speed right there. So yeah, top speed on this car and looks like it's 127. Well done. Yeah. We. Yeah. Yoink, yoink. And I think the one in Seattle. Oh, I'll set Seattle Cross for some reason. Right. Right, anyways. So, that was probably the easiest race so far. I don't know. Yeah. The, la the last race, though, will probably be interesting. I don't know. I win, so see what we win. Uh, Cobra 427. That is a muscle car, technically. So, hooray! The game actually didn't score up this time. I don't know. Right, anyways. So, that's a cool prize. But I'm gonna sit with my, uh, Shelby. 350. For the small race, which is gonna be at yeah, Laguna Seca. This race will be pretty freaking interesting. Especially since, uh, you know, this car is craziness. And I mean, just what I'm going to say in general, it's going to make things all sorts of things, and this is going to freaking say, though. I see my doing an endurance race again at some point. I don't know why. Because I'm one of those people who watch the end of the endurance races on the way immediately, mostly because they're very boring. <laughs> and who wants to sit around for hours doing endurance races? I certainly don't. 
Oh yeah, all about this group. Here we go. But yeah, I certainly don't want to be doing a race for hours. And that's mostly why I don't like endurance racing. So yeah. I'm surprised I pulled us down a second here. New ball. So I'm probably a second right here on the straight way. Yay, I am winning really well right now, actually. Hey. And I see the Cornette is jerked between the second, alright. Now the race begins. Maybe. I'm surprised I'm not like going all in the road right now. Oops. Way off trap. Look out for this one again. Okay, that's how it went way better. And there we go. Last of the of car series completed. Woo. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, there's not really much to say about it. Other than, um, that was awesome because I love using classic muscle cars. And they also look really awesome. Yeah, so let's see what car we win for our last race. We win the... I don't know how to pronounce that. Phantom? Phantom? I don't even know. Oh my. Wow, that car is... That car is really weird. It looks like a limousine. And, uh, and to be honest with you, that car actually looks kind of ugly. I mean, seriously, this car looks kind of ugly. I, I just do not like the way it looks. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. Anyway, so if you enjoyed this video, please do a like and also comment down in the comment section below how you found this video. And then, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and do the final series in the second lineup. So, um, yeah. So, this has been a fan with the Mark Fisher and I'll see you guys later.